guys, it's Whitney. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I do videos all about activewear. I do try-ons, hauls, and reviews. And for today's video, I'm going to be talking about some new arrivals to Lululemon and specifically shorts. A lot of these shorts I've been unable to find in store, so I placed an order online. And I hope you guys find this video helpful if you are thinking about ordering some shorts. If you do find it helpful, make sure to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. And let's jump into the video. Like I said, I placed an order for a bunch of shorts. So here's my package. I think I have about six pairs. It doesn't look like that many, but yeah, they're just crammed in there tightly. So I'm gonna get into these. Almost all of these shorts are new shorts to me, ones that I have not tried on. I just wanted to try out some new styles, but the first pair are actually a pair that I love and I have a couple colors and that is the Hottie Hot short. This is what they look like. And I got the white color and these are the high rise short. They are the 2.5 inch. Um, the reason I ordered these is because the high rise are kind of hard to find in store, especially in the basic colors like white. And I actually do have a 2.5 Hottie Hot short, but they're not high rise and I just never wear them. So I actually sold them on Poshmark. So I decided to just get the high rise because I'll wear them a lot more than the older ones I had that I never wore. One of my favorite things about the white Hottie Hot shorts are they do have a liner right here, but it's a nude liner. So if this were to be a white liner, it would really show through the short but with it being closer to your skin tone, I noticed that the liner is really not that noticeable when you have the shorts on. So I really, really like that feature. Also, I just wanna say I ordered a size six because I feel like the fours and the hottie hots for me are just a little bit too tight. So I like to size up and the great thing about sizing up in these shorts is on the front, they do have a pull tie um, draw cord. So, you know, if you need to tighten them a little bit around your waist, you definitely can do that. They also have in the inside on that liner, they have just a little small pocket right here, which would be good for a key. And then they do have an outside pocket as well as a little hidden zip pocket, both pretty small pockets, but nice features. I've definitely put my house key and mail key in there before when going on walks. And then the other thing I want to note is they do have some mesh side detailing right here, which I think is really pretty. I just overall really like the white short. I love the thick waistband, and I'm really happy that I finally have the high rise in the white shorts. Next up is a pair of shorts I don't have. Like I said, the rest of these, I do not have these styles or these fit of the shorts. And that is the Track That High Rise Short in the three inch length. I think three inch length for shorts is almost perfect. Um, it just gives you enough coverage, but it doesn't feel too long. So I have the tracker short. I'm not sure if the track that short is gonna replace the tracker short, but I don't have these, so I wanted to try them out. They do have, again, a really thick waistband like the Hottie Hot shorts. And then on the back, they have some really nice detailing in the seams like this. They kind of it's hard to explain holding it up, but you guys will see in the try-on, they kind of have like this U shape. And then on the side, they come together right here. And so I have, I feel like this is nice to have like a thicker leg opening. So if you do have larger quads, you won't have an issue about it being too tight. Um, they do have a liner in the shorts. So just like the Hottie Hot shorts, they have just a black liner. Um, they also have the drawstring cord. Again, so that's really nice. I went with a size four in these. I don't know if I should have gone with a size six, maybe, but these do fit. Uh, there's something a little funky, in my opinion, on the back of these shorts. I think it maybe is my butt being too big. I'm not really sure, but you'll see in the try on what I mean. It just has like a little bit extra fabric here. My tracker shorts that I have, I actually cut the liner out because I felt like they fit more high rise. The liner was like pulling them down. So you know that if you cut the liner out of these shorts, that might solve the problem. Um, I would only suggest cutting liners out of shorts if they are a dark color. You do not wanna do that on the light shorts color. But overall, I think this is a good short. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it. If I do keep it, I will likely be cutting the liner out. Next up is the Speed Up Short. 
but these are actually the high rise fit and they're also four inch. So in store, I tried on these shorts. They had a high rise and it was because it was an online return. They really don't sell the high rise in store, at least the ones around me. Um, but it was a 2.5 inch. I liked them, but I felt like they were just slightly a little bit too short. I like the four inch length, but I'm very curious to see what a three inch length would fit like. But I really do like the high rise fit. I don't have any speed up shorts. I used to back in the day when I ran all the time, I loved the speed up shorts, but I actually ended up selling all of them because I switched over to the hottie hot shorts and that's really been my favorite. But I really do love these shorts. I think the four inch is good. If you want shorts that have a little bit more coverage, the four inch option is great. Um, the back of these shorts, the speed up shorts, I feel like are iconic. They've been really a popular Lululemon short for a long time, but they have this open venting here. Um, good running short. I think that's what the intention is for the shorts. And they have kind of the side open panel here. They do have a liner and then they also have a zipper on the back. I really love this zipper. Again, when I used to run a ton, I would just put my key fob in here when I was on a trail and it was so handy. Um, and then they do have the inner drawstring cord here. And this color, I'll have to put the information. I can't remember the exact color. I don't think it says it on the tag, but I love this. It's kind of like a light blue with gray specks. I just think this is a beautiful color and it's still kind of neutral. So I like that. It would look good with like a white tank top or a gray tank top. So these are an awesome short. The high rise fit is so nice. I cannot get away with the hottie hot shorts in the regular low rise fit. Just does not look good on me, is not comfortable. So I highly recommend if you like the speed up shorts, um, go with the high rise fit. Again, this is the four inch, but they also have a 2.5 inch. Also, I think I forgot to mention, I went with the size four and they fit great. So with these ones, I think you can probably go up one size if you want a little bit more room. But for me, the standard size four, which is my true to size fits great. Next up is a new short to Lululemon and I was really excited to get my hands on it because it used to be, well, it is a jogger and they decided to make it into a short. And that is the Dance Studio High Rise Short. This is what it looks like. So it is a good athleisure lounge style short and it reminds me a lot of the ones I talked about in my old Navy haul. So I'll link that video. It does have that look going for it. it has the big front pockets. These are a 3.5 inch length, just wanna mention that. I really love the length of these shorts. Also has the tie cord here, the little metal ties. It does not have a liner. I don't feel like these shorts need a liner because they are pretty thick and they are long, so you don't need a liner. And I really think the intention for these shorts is more for like casual wear, so maybe going in walks or things like that. I would totally wear these on a hike though. I think they'd be perfect for that. I really love the fit of these shorts. I think these are a great option. If you have the Dance Studio jogger, the material is the same up on the top, just like those joggers. They're really stretchy right here. So it has, I think like a two-way stretch maybe. Let's see what it says. Yep, two-way stretch fabric. Um, and then I went with the size four. The size four fits me great. I recommend sticking with your true to size. The only downfall about these shorts is right now on Lululemon's website, they only have this color, which this is a nice color, but I'd like to see a few more options, you know, at least like a black, a gray, and a white. I feel like that would be nice. So maybe it's because it's a new short, they don't have a lot of color options yet, but maybe if they get popular, they might release some more colors. I would really like to see that. Highly recommend this short if you're looking for an athleisure short. These are a great, great option. Next up is another new short to Lululemon. I was really excited to get my hands on it. It is the scuba short. So the scuba joggers have always been really popular and now they have a short. So this is what they look like. They are the high rise fits. They are a five inch length. So they are a longer short. I do think they're still really cute. They're just kind of like that comfy athleisure look. I think this would look really nice with one of the scuba oversized cropped hoodies. I think that would be a very cute look. I think for me though, they might be a tad bit too long. Um, you know, I think an option is taking them into Lululemon and having them take off like an inch or inch and a half if they were four or 3.5 inches. I think they would be perfect. They do have two big pockets in the front and a tie drawstring cord. They're just overall a very comfy, nice athleisure look. And I absolutely love this color. 
This is date brown. I think this is just like a gorgeous color that they have right now. One downfall with these shorts though is they are pricey compared to the other shorts. These ones are $78. So very pricey, but if you absolutely love the scuba line, I think this would be a great addition to your collection. Just a really good comfy lounge short. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe so I can see you in my next video. Oops.